Now normally when you want to scan something, what you need to do is take your phone and kind of align it like this and you're kind of not getting the right position and it's not a good uh, quality camera. But today we have a fix for you. Here we go. What's happening YouTube, your boy Tech Tricks back in another video and today we're looking at the Caesar Shine Ultra. Here we go. First things first, make sure to hit that subscribe button below, hit the notification bell so you can notify the next videos to come, tips, tricks, and unboxing just like this one. Check out my merch below at momentary.ca if you want to get one of these, I'll link this down below. Make sure to hit that like button as well so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. And today we're looking at the Caesar. I'm pretty new at this product as well, but we're going to show you today how it works and if it's any good or not. If you are struggling a lot with scanning books, any books, maybe um, colorful designs for your project or maybe for your business, this is, might be the one for you. Let's go ahead and show you what it could do. Here we go. This has tons of features like multi-scanning. You can scan multiple things all at once. It also has auto scanning. So you can just flip the page and it'll scan for you. You can also use this on Zoom as a video presenter. And then um, you'll be able to scan every book out there really easy really quick as well and then you'll be able to send it out to your publisher or something like that or maybe you have designs that you want to get all the details and also the colorful designs and put it online you'll be able to do that as well so with this we get the there we go. that's all in the box there you go few things in here like it comes with a mat as well right there here it comes with a foot pedal as well here there is a USB cable you plug in your scanner right there then it comes with the finger cards for book scanning put those inside for now and there you go. Now let's unravel this and see what else we can. There you go. Pretty cool design by Caesar. There you go. It's a few things that it could do. Extend up like that. And then you just 90 degree it just like that. And you're good to go. This is also a quite compact design as you can see there. Could fit it on your backpack or something like that. The bottom here, there's a knob to turn on and off the light and also to dim it and uh, make the light brighter if you need to. On the top, it has a camera and also two lights. Very bright so that you can see the detail of your of what you're scanning. You really need this so that you can get all the details on your drawings. And for the port, it has a USB-B and a USB-A. USB-A is for the pedal and the USB-B is to connect it to your computer, Mac or PC. Now the next step is to go to caesar.com which is their official website here and go to download software. Here we're going to download the software for the Shine Ultra and then we're going to go ahead and install that software. Make sure you are downloading the right software for the device that you have. So if you have different Caesar uh, scanners then go ahead and download that for that device. Now depending on which computer you install this or you hooked it up on um, we are going to use the mac today you can also use windows for this like i said just download the right software for it and you should be good to go go ahead and install that once it's done installing let's go ahead and open it up here we're going to put the serial number which is uh, found in the bottom of the device once it's good to go it should look like this um you'll be able to see if the device works by clicking the scan button on the right right hand side as you can see there yeah it works very well it's showing the images right here from our um, shine ultra 
One key feature here is that it'll actually detect the book or whatever literature you are trying to scan on the Shine Ultra. I like how it would crop it for you. You just need to place the book or the literature on the mat and then it'll be able to scan everything for you no problem at all you can uh, rotate it to whatever you want you can place it anywhere in the page even and it'll crop it to however you like it'll rotate it to however you like now once you are ready to go go ahead and click the button on the right bottom side there and as you could see it'll show the things that you have scanned on the left side of the page there now for example you want to scan a whole book all you need to do is hit that auto scan check mark right there and then go ahead and click the same button to scan go ahead and flip the page like so and then it'll scan it for you automatically i don't have to click anything as you could see my mouse is not moving so yeah everything is automatic it'll auto scan right away which is pretty cool now you can also use the pedal to scan. So basically you could just hit the pedal with your foot. It's still hands-free. Both of your hands are still available to flip the pages. Now, for example, you're a guy like me and you've just scanned the whole thing upside down. You can go ahead and hit select all and then actually edit everything all at once. So that's pretty good. Here, as you could see on the left side as well, there's a lot of features that you can um, use so that you can edit your uh, individual scans or maybe the whole thing as well. So as you could see there, we're flipping everything right side up now. And then also you can change the contrast and uh, maybe take out shine marks as well on the pages. Very nice. Now, for example, you only want to see the one side or the one thing on the scans. You can also crop it like this. And then one key feature as well is the watermark. So, for example, you have a lot of scans, but you want to give this to the client, but not the original thing. You can go ahead and put a watermark on there so that they won't be able to copy it. Now, maybe you're not happy with the automatic cropping, so you can go ahead and uh, change that yourself as well manually. Another feature as well, which is I think is pretty cool, is multiple scanning. So for example, you have IDs and different business cards that you want to scan. You can go ahead and have multiple things on all at once right here and um, be able to scan it all at once and crop it for you automatically as well. A lot of ways to scan as well with the color, black and white, grayscale. You can also have combined sides where you can scan the front of your ID and then the back of the ID. And then you can also export it as a Word document or also a Excel PDF or maybe a searchable PDF, whatever you want, even a TIFF file. Now, for those of you who are working online as a teacher and you want to show your books online, you'll be able to use the video presenter as well. Here, you'll be able to draw some lines, um, draw whatever shapes you want, and then you can also edit the video so that the people can see the text on on the textbook so that's pretty good um yeah it's just a really easy device so that you'll be able to show your students what you need to show from the textbook you can also even freeze the page so that people can jot notes while you're at it and that's it for today guys thanks for watching i hope i was able to help you on your choice on a brand new scanner just like here by caesar if i was able to help you make sure to hit that subscribe button below if you want to get one of these i'll link this down below so go ahead and check this out now if you are getting one i have a discount code on the description below so go ahead and check that out you will save about 12 percent on this scanner so that's pretty good Make sure to hit that like button as well so we can beat that YouTube algorithm. I hope you guys have a good day and stay grateful. Peace.